What new happened at the school today, Shiny? Sasha? Pa, I have been chosen for a science project. That's nice. What are you making? We have to show clouds and rain. We? It's a team. Teacher selected four of us, but I don't like them. I want to work alone. But will you be able to make such a big model by yourself? I will, Pa. I will tell teacher to keep me alone. Ah. But before that, you must listen to the story of poor oxen. Yay! Story time! time! Once on a far away farmland, there lived four oxen. They were best friends and were always together. Now, nearby lived a lion. His sights were on those four oxen. How fat those four oxen are! What a nice meal they will make! But they are always together. Let me make another try. But the oxen were very clever. Whenever the lion came, the oxen came close to each other and stood with their long horns pointing outwards like a big wall. Oh no! They have come together. Those horns, they look so dangerous. <laughs> Due to this, the lion could never attack the oxen. Now, a few days later, Something terrible happened. The oxen had a fight. The fight was bitter and long and oxen could not find a solution to it. The oxen vowed to never talk to each other. They did not want to see each other's faces either. In their anger, they went to four different corners of the large farmland and began to graze there. The lion saw this. He was waiting for just an opportunity. Seeing the oxen were now alone, he pounced upon each of them and made a meal of the four fighting oxen. In the fight of the four friends, only the lion, who was an outsider, profited. So kids, the moral of the story is, unity is strength. So you see, unity is strength. That is why your teacher has made a team. Everyone is important to the team. I see. When we are in a group, we are stronger. Right. So I hope you will be good to your friends now. I will, Pa. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I am Shiny. If you like this story, then please share it. And don't forget to tell your friends and subscribe the channel.